Welcome back to Passionate About Tech. In this video, we'll guide you through an easy way to clear all junk files from Windows 11 and Windows 10, boosting your computer's performance. We'll cover how to remove temporary files, cache data, and other clutter step by step. This works for most computers, so let's get started right away. First, let's tackle junk files using the run command to clear the prefetch folder. Press the Windows key and R key together. This opens the run window. Type prefetch and hit enter. A folder will open and you might see a permission prompt. Click continue. Select any file, press control plus A to highlight everything, then press shift plus delete to permanently remove them. A confirmation might pop up. Click yes. This deletes cached startup data that can slow things down over time. Next, let's clean the temp folder. Press Windows key and R again. Type T-E-M-P and hit enter. This opens a folder with temporary files. Even on a clean system, some junk might linger. Select any file, press Control plus A, then Shift plus Delete. These are leftovers from apps and updates. Getting rid of them frees up space. If some files won't delete, that's okay. They might be in use. Just skip those. Now, let's hit the percent temp percent folder. Press Windows key and R once more. Type percentage, T-E-M-P, percentage, and hit enter. This shows encrypted junk files not created by you, safe to remove. Select all with Control plus A, then Shift plus Delete. If some files are locked by running programs, choose to skip them when prompted. This step gradually clears hidden clutter, helping your system run smoother. Another built-in method is using disk cleanup. Press Windows key and R again. Type clean MGR and hit enter. This opens disk cleanup. By default, it selects the C drive where Windows lives. Click OK. In the window, check all boxes. Recycle bin, temporary files, thumbnails, delivery optimization files, temporary internet files. Then click OK. This wipes out more junk, making your computer feel fresher. If asked to delete, confirm with delete files. Let's add a modern approach with storage settings. Open the start menu, click settings, look for the gear icon, go to system, then scroll to storage. Click storage sense or configure storage sense, turn it on if it's off. Now, click Cleanup Recommendations. You'll see a Clean button. Check all options like Temporary Files and Previous Windows Installations, and you might see Downloads folder too. Be careful, don't check Downloads unless you're sure, as it might delete files you need. I leave it unchecked myself. Then hit Cleanup. This automates junk removal and can recover gigabytes, especially after updates. Next, let's try clearing system cache using command prompt. Press Windows key and R, type CMD, and hit Enter. This opens command prompt. Type ipconfig slash flush DNS and press Enter. You'll see a success message. This clears DNS cache. Another option is clearing browser cache manually. Open your browser, Chrome, Edge, whatever. Click the three-dot menu, go to Settings, then Privacy and Security. Find Clear Browsing Data, check Cached Images and Files, set the time range to All Time, and click Clear Data. This removes web junk slowing your browser. Repeat for each browser you use. After any method, restart your computer to see the difference. Open Task Manager by right-clicking the taskbar. Go to Performance and check if free space or speed improved. If some files won't delete, don't force it. They might be in use. Repeat these steps monthly to keep your system lean. That covers our easy guide to clearing junk files. We've removed temporary data, used built-in tools, and explored extra options to speed up your Windows 10 or 11 machine. If this helped, Hit that subscribe button for more tech tips. I've got storage upgrades coming next. Like if you notice the boost and comment your favorite method below. Thanks for joining Passionate About Tech. See you next time.